hi in this video let us discuss how to control the speed of the dc motor using pwm technique and by writing a program in 8051c okay and what type of motor that we are going to use uh, electronic motors that uh, used to for um, robotic applications and for any other automation applications okay so let us see the uh, problem statement so write an 8051c program to monitor the status of the switch and perform the following so what do we have to do uh, the switch is connected to p2.7 if it is one it should produce a 25 percentage duty cycle if it is zero then microcontroller should produce 50 percentage duty cycle that will be outputted to the micro uh, from the microcontroller okay so how to write the simple statements related to it so what do we have the rich 51 a dot h it's a header file then sw it is named for p2.7 and uh, mtr since we are using only one pin so p1.0 is named as mtr then there is a subroutine that we have used here called ms delay and it takes an argument uh, called value of integer type and does not return a um, value then the main program is written here then what do we have uh, the in the main program first we set the switch to one so that it can receive the inputs then initially we off the motor and when the motor is off now we start with our continuous operation in our continuous operation what do we do first yes we monitor the condition of the switch if the switch is equal to one what should be produced 25 percentage duty cycle should be produced okay so here what do we do uh, first we have to see you can see the 25 percent duty cycle waveform is given here initially it is going to be zero then we have to make it one and we have to generate a delay to produce this part isn't it okay so what do we do here if the switch is equal to one then motor is changed to one the motor output p1.0 is changed to one then what we have to do very good you have to call for a delay delay subroutine is going to be called where is the delay subroutine it is here okay it's a out of main program so ms delay a value and there are some for loops are going to be used and this statement is not going to have any body and by repeating this statement uh, no by using the another above for loop we can generate a, a, some delay so by taking the value into it we'll get a 25 percentage uh, on period we will get it here okay then off period also we have to generate off period how long 75 percentage so take to, uh, zero uh, to the mtr so that will make from one to zero here then call the delay with the value delay subroutine with the value 75 that will get you uh, the 75 percentage delay being generated here so 25 percentage plus 70 percentage 100 percentage uh, time period is generated here with this particular part of a program next what do we have yes good switch is equal to zero switch is equal to zero how much 50 percentage duty cycle it has to produce isn't it 50 percentage means equal on period equal off period so you have a delay subroutine what value we have to pass here we have to pass five zero into it isn't it okay so let us see that so else represents switch is equal to zero switch is equal to zero means then motor is on it is changed from zero to one then we pass uh, number 50 into that uh, subroutine that, gen that generates a 50 percentage of the time period total time period uh, delay then we change it to zero again we call the subroutine with the 50 value only so that it will generate another 50 percentage totally 100 percentage is produced here understand so by writing a simple program like this with a microcontroller we can generate a pwm wave that will change the duty cycle based on the switch condition isn't it okay then what if if you want to rotate the motor at all four speeds low speed uh, moderate speed high speed and to the rated value okay 
so for this we have the different setup here okay let us see a simple example let us say there are two pins uh, are connected of the microcontroller are connected to two switches uh, the pin numbers are p2.0 and p2.1 and we call it as switch 2 and switch 1 okay if it is 0 0 then slow speed if it is switches one one is on and switch two is zero then moderate speed switch two is one and switch one is zero then it is at fast then if both are one it is going to rotate at a very high speed okay that's a rated speed how to achieve this all these spell we were using only one switch but now we are using multiple switches got it so then what we can do the simple uh, construct that we can use here is called switch case construct that we can use based on that we can monitor the uh, condition of the switch and we can write a program got it okay now i have a question how to generate uh, how to rotate the motor at a slow speed what do you basically have to use very good that is 25 percentage then moderate speed 50 percentage so if it's one zero, it's 75 percentage. If it's one one, it's going to be 100 percentage. Okay, so like that by using different duty cycle, we can rotate the motor at a different speeds. How to do it? Okay, so what do we have? We have a reg51.h header file. Then the motor is uh, named for the pin, uh, pin v1.0. Then there is a subroutine MS delay. Even the previously discussed subroutine also can be used here. So the concept here is, um, what do we do? We use a local variable called Z. So it's of constant character type. Then P2 is the pin through which we are going to um, collect the switch inputs. So we are we are configuring the P2 as input. Then whatever is there in P2, we pass it on to Z. Okay, and since we are connected to the pin to only to the two pins of the port P2, then what do we do? We uh, cover the previous, uh, the lower uh, or higher bits, and we take only the last two bits by ending with ending the Z value with 0, 3. Understand? Okay. Then, then we uh, initially we stop the motor by using uh, the 0 value to the motor pin then then what do we do we go for the switch case statement okay in your c program you might have studied earlier so using switch case program we are monitoring the value of z value of z if the value of z is zero that means case zero case zero what do you have to do it is zero zero case zero means zero zero so zero zero means slow speed. So what do you have to do? We have to produce 25 percent duty cycle. So what do you have to do? So set the motor pin one, then call a subroutine by passing the value 25 into it. Then you reduce it to zero. And for how long it should be zero? It should be zero for 75 percentage. Okay. Then case goes done. Similarly, case one. Case one means what? 0 1 value case 1 means 0 1 value so for 0 1 then what will be the setup same thing it's going to be 50 percentage so delay subroutine it's going to take the value 50 50 okay so mtr1 is equal to 1 ms delay 50 the mtr1 is 0 and uh, again 50 so that will produce then for 75 what we have to produce send yes 75 percentage on period and 25 percentage off period okay so 75 percent 75 integer value is passed to the delay and 75 25 integer value is passed for the delay for generating the off period on period done 75 percentage off period 25 percentage fine then what is the last one we have only the one one okay so for any other condition by using default construct we can say for any other condition the motor will be running at a high speed so that the full voltage is given here if one means the logic value one means um, analog voltage 5 voltage will be given here understand 
so by using the switch case statements also we can write a uh, program to interface 805 microcontroller to rotate at different speeds by generating a pulse of different duty cycles through pin p1.0 okay thanks for watching